I'm going to do an exercise for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. If you are new to Siamese Mahjong, look for a link in the video description below to a demonstration. There's also a link to the rules. Siamese Mahjong with National Mahjong League rules is a little different because we're playing two hands at one time with only one opponent as opposed to a four player game. So the scoring is a little more complex. In this video, we're gonna practice. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just wanna build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. These are hands from a game I played at Siamese Mahjong. I was player one, and then this is player two. We were getting late in the game, and they declared this hand. They self-picked, but they decided to declare it. So this would be the first year hand. Then they discarded this tile, which was a winning tile for my concealed hand. Because they declared a winning hand and it was late in the game, I decided to claim it for a win. So here we have a concealed hand that was claimed by discard. And the game ended with both of us having two incomplete hands. Score this. If I were playing in a live game, I would say player two has 25 points for this hand. Player one has a concealed hand, which is 35 points, but it's jokerless. So they get double the value. So this would be 70 points. 70 points minus 25 points is 45 points. So this player would owe this player 45 points. Let's see how Siamese Mahjong scored the hand. This player, 25 points. This player, 35 points doubled because it was jokerless. So 70 points and the difference is 45 points. For Siamese Mahjong, scoring is part of the game and timing is critical because if your opponent has a winning hand and you are holding out for a simultaneous mahjong, you might consider declaring one of those hands to offset the cost just in case that simultaneous win doesn't come in or your opponent declares another winning hand. In the end, the total score for both players is compared and you settle up. So it's all about the total value of the hands declared. The hands that are not complete have no value. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click that little gray bell if you do, that way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next, score this for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. May all your picks be keepers.